Hello Aries, welcome to your love reading for September. Let's jump on in and see what we got for you, shall we? Okay, Aries, September, Aries. Yeah, be careful about being led on, okay? Yeah, be careful about being led on by someone or you thinking something's going to work out and it doesn't, okay? Yeah, I feel like you need to evaluate your, um, your intentions and someone else's intentions, okay? Because I feel like you are looking to move forward and someone's just looking for looking for just now type of thing. Okay. Yeah, you need to definitely take inventory this month on relationships. Okay. And not get overly attached or codependent on someone. That looks really good because you may need some attention or something like that. Somebody is just very flirty with you, okay? Uh, I feel like the more that you talk to them, the more that they start to reveal themselves. And this may be someone from your past, okay? Also, they may be trying to reconcile with someone from their past. So I would definitely pay attention to that, okay? Let's dig in some more. Yeah, you definitely got your guard down a little bit, Leo. Um, and that is going to mess you up, okay? Um, I feel like you need to pay more attention and not be shy about saying what it is that you want to say. It's almost like you don't want to mess something up if it's going to be good. So you're kind of holding your tongue a little bit and that's not right. Yeah, someone you're dealing with is still out playing in the field and you're trying to invest time and energy into them because you think they might actually be somebody serious. Yeah, this person is like going through heartbreak from someone else, okay? Um, I feel like they're not looking for anything serious and they're going to be kind of emotionally distant. If you have an intimate, intimate relation, sex with this person, don't be surprised if they get a little distant. Um, yeah, they want someone back. This is someone who wants someone back. Um, also, you may like say, hey, I want to go on a date with this person or try to work it out and then they don't show up or the date doesn't go well. Yeah. This person doesn't care for you as much as you care for them. And that um, is something that you really need to pay attention to, Aries, okay? Yeah, uh, I feel like this feels like kind of trying to make excuses for someone because you really like them. But not seeing that this whole partnership is like not right. It's like you're making excuses like, oh, it's because of this or it's because of this. But really, it's just them not doing the right thing. Um, I feel like they're going to get distant and you need to accept this distance for what it is. You know, it doesn't mean that you need to open up your heart more to this person or do more. It just means that they're not on the same page as you are, unfortunately. Um Yeah, they they are trying to do too much too fast. It's like they're trying to bed you really, really fast uh, or get your attention or get close to you really, really fast. I feel like that is uh, definitely a red flag here. Um, and then they just stop. Lack of communication. And I feel like you're being passive. And they're using that. Yeah, they're using that to um, kind of connect with you. 
I feel like there's somebody else here. Yeah, they have an interest in someone else. Um, like, that's their main focus um, is that other person. And they're waiting for that person to, like, communicate or contact with them. Um, I would be really cautious with your heart here, Aries, okay? Yeah, this one's going to surprise you because you feel like, It's going to feel like a big loss. Um, it's like you thought this was going to work out. Yeah, like you thought this was going to work out. You got a little bit too attached and then it just hits you. Um, but I will say this, by the end of September, you will know the truth of what's happening. Um, it's like you see that this person is just living by their own rules and doing what they want to do. They kind of been doing that from the beginning, to be completely honest with you. Yeah, it's like they they they're trying to like get patience out of you, like for you to be more patient with them or they have to heal and all this kind of stuff, like kind of making excuses. But it stops them from having to step forward or having to move forward with you. Yeah, they're definitely trying to keep things light. That's how you'll know this person. Flirty, um, playful, trying to keep things kind of open or trying to keep their heart open. Yeah, because they're still messed up about a relationship that didn't work out in the way they wanted to. Um, they really want this person back. I'm going to be honest. It's like they just they just want this person back. They're they're involved in this. Um, it's like they're want. You're here physically, but this is like a want and a desire for them, unfortunately. Okay. Yep. Your lack of closure with this situation, if you continue to keep it open, uh, will overstep your boundaries. So you have to put your boundaries up and know what's right for you. You want a certain kind of love and a certain kind of attention that you deserve. And this is not happening here. Okay. And it's just a realization of what it is that you truly deserve in your life. You have to put up those boundaries, Aries. You have to. Okay. Uh, or it's just going to keep continuing like this, like this person will leave and come back and all of this kind of stuff if you allow them to do that. OK, this one was pretty quick, but thank you, Aries. I love you and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.